Big shout out to all my subscribers. Thanks for tuning in. Here we go with 2021. Today we're heading down to the bottom end of Tasmania to rip apart a 35 meter eucalyptus. It's got crazy amounts of rot in the trunk of this thing. It's huge around the butt. So anyhow, stay tuned and um, yeah, we'll bring you all the crazy footage from doing this big one. Stay tuned. Here we go, 2021. Big tree straight off the rank. Get these Evos on. Easiest knot of the day, the shoelaces. Many years ago, a limb fell off the side of this eucalyptus. The tree unfortunately now has heart rock fungus in it and makes it a very unsafe tree for my clients to be living and working around. Step one, get your climb line on. This is just spur and flip line climbing. Gonna get up pretty high up here so that I can uh, set this MRS line up. Just paint that over there like that. That's it. That's got him. Put that on there. Happy days, now we can go out here and do all this. This is one of the old Petzl zigzags. Been using this one now for about three years. Everything still looks really good on it. I know there's some other devices out there now that are really cool, but I still like using this zigzag. I'll go out here and start doing a bit of work. These are the first cuts. For good direction, don't get your climb line under things that you're gonna be cutting, because it'll drag you away from the tree. Always take it off, move it. Before you take it off your bridge, make sure you've got another point of attachment in case you fall, because nobody likes to be hurt on any job site. down there. 30 days having a good day. This is what we live for boys. I'm just out here bouncing around on this thing. It's quite fun. Still enjoying my job. Been doing this now for nearly 12 years. So exciting work. As I was saying before, make sure your climb line is out of the way when dropping off any wood because if you don't, it could be the last thing you do. You do not want to be dragged out of a big tree like this with something getting snagged on your rope, on your climb line. People come out and start doing tree work like this and figure out that, uh, figure out just how dangerous the bloody industry is. So, so I'm just going to take all of this off now, all this here, 
all this up here. I'll switch it back on when I start to get up into the top of the tree up there. Nice work, Race. Reese is attaching the 916 Samson down here to the uh, excavator. Now this might seem silly to you people, but that is our client's letterbox. And we don't want to destroy it. 